Little Owl's Snow by Devaya Siranavsa. A chill cut through the forest. Little Owl fluffed his feathers. Something is happening, he thought. Green leaves turned orange, gold, and brown, and then began to fall. Geese flew off to warmer places, navigating by starlight and honking all the way. Dry fallen leaves rustled and crackled as animals scurried, preparing for the cold. Bear was eating all day and into the night. Winter's almost here, Little Owl said. Isn't it exciting? Winter's too cold, Bear shuddered. I'm staying in. Bear sleeps through all the fun, Raccoon whispered. You'll see. Bats disappeared into a cave. Caterpillars closed up their cocoons. Goodbye, Hedgehog called. See you in spring, as he wiggled into his warm winter home. Little Owl thought he saw a moth, but it was only a leaf in the wind. The forest felt so empty now. Ah, the friends were making fog when it happened. Ah, snow! Soon the forest was blanketed in snow. Tiny crystals. Soon the forest was blanketed in snow. Its crystals glinting in the light. Tracks began to appear. Not everyone was hidden away. Little Owl hopped atop the frozen pond, watching fish swim underneath. How strange and wonderful it all was. But one night, Little Owl started to miss Hedgehog. Mama, Little Owl asked, how much longer till spring? Snow is like a special secret not everyone can know, Mama said. Are you ready for it to melt away so soon? The forest was very quiet. Little Owl could hear the smallest sounds. Tap, tap. An icicle dripped onto a patch of slush. Mama told Little Owl he would see fireflies again. He would see Hedgehog too, soon enough. Right now though, it was time to enjoy the snow. The end.